क्या चक्कर की वजह से भी टेनाइटिस की प्रॉब्लम हो सकती है आइए पेशेंट का फीडबैक सुनते हैं मैम फॉर गिविंग अस द फीडबैक ऑन बिहाफ ऑफ योर मदर मैम मे आई नो हर एज ओके एंड मैम शी बिलोंग्स टू विच प्लेस belongs to which place which place we belong to uh, bangalore okay ma'am uh, since how long she is struggling from this tinnitus problem uh, i think close around to 7 8 years uh, she has been having this tinnitus problem okay and uh, are you are you aware of the cause like how this problem actually started no it all suddenly started uh, on this one fine day with uh, vertigo and uh, vomiting okay and after so perfectly fine it suddenly started all of a sudden all of a sudden and when you came to know that she is having this kind of a problem what was your next step so we had consulted the uh, uh, ent mm-hmm. and uh, we had taken the anti vertigo medications and uh, we try to take some certain medications like uh, pini care and all mm-hmm. okay hello yes yes hello yes ma'am she started with uh, vomit uh, dizziness and vomiting okay and uh, and the vomiting stopped after a day then dizziness was persisting okay. i was not able to go to any doctor mm-hmm. but only over the phone i was able to take the treatment for the Then the thing vomiting and giddiness. Okay. Then suddenly the tinnitus uh, uh, problem started after ten to fifteen days. Okay. Then which I uh, I was able to go to the doctor. <laughs> Then he diagnosed it as a many years disease. Okay. Then he didn't give me any medicine. From that time onwards, I was suffering. Okay. So you were having many years disease because of that it started. Yes, yes, she was have, having many other diseases. Yes. Okay, so with this problem, what other associated problem she was facing? One second. See, I am a diabetic. Okay. And I am a hypothyroid also. Okay. So the true problem was there, and it is there since the age of fifty years. Okay. And 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 that. But... See, I am a diabetic. Okay. And I am a hypothyroid also. Okay. So the true problem was there, and it is there since the age of fifty years. Okay. And 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 that but it's under control. Okay. Control. Okay. So, uh, when how you came to know about us basically? Yeah, we came across the YouTube videos. Okay. Uh, that was uh, posted. So my mom used to uh, check for any uh, uh, treatments uh, on YouTube and. Uh, Uh, internet mm-hmm. so she came across your uh, one of the video where uh, there was a demo that was happening and it was explained about what is the process so we thought we will just try that out also okay so uh, mom uh, when she started uh, her treatment uh, you know in how much time she felt little better and in what conditions you people felt she is feeling good sorry can you repeat the last part mom uh, in what uh, Think she felt better, and as you are a family member, so what changes you felt in her after starting this treatment? Yeah, actually, um, there have been up and down for this treatment. So initially, there was um, one second. So yeah, after six months of starting of the treatment, mm-hmm. I initially I used to have heaviness of the head, and all the time getting irritated. And uh, not able to uh, concentrate on anything. Actually, I was practicing my the thing uh, as a pediatrician, but I was not able to continue because of the stimulator. Mm-hmm. And that year, I I had the hard of hearing also started. Yeah. 
then after six months of starting your treatment, I felt little that the heaviness of the head was not there, and uh, otherwise uh, the sound also, you no, know, the nature of the sound also changed. Okay. And so currently, how's your situation? If I ask you out of hundred percent, how much percent you feel it's better from before? How much percent is it better from before? See, from before, it is now till today seventy percent. But what happens, you know, continuously for one week, I won't be hearing anything. Hmm. I will feel as if I become normal. But suddenly, just again, the family member. So. What changes you felt in her after starting this treatment? Yeah, actually, um, there have been up and down for this treatment. So initially, there was um, one second. So after six months of starting of the treatment, mm-hmm. I initially I used to have heaviness of the head and all the time getting irritated and uh, not able to uh, concentrate on anything. Actually, I was practicing my the thing uh, as a pediatrician, but I was not able to continue because of the stimulator. Mm-hmm. And that year, I I had the hard of hearing also started. Yeah. Then after six months of starting your treatment, I felt little that the heaviness of the head was not there, and. Uh, नॉर्मल But suddenly, just again the sound started. That now the nature of the sound, no, as if the wind is blowing, and yeah. that will be very bad. And it will be there for two or three times. And that time, I think initially it started with the treatment of every uh, four times a day mm-hmm. for ten minutes. Mm-hmm. Then slowly it was. Uh, I was asked to take only for. Three times. Yeah. Then we made it over two times. Mm-hmm. Then when I started getting this uh, noise again, you know, this uh, this uh, nature of the noise has changed. So I was asked to take whenever there is a noise. Okay. But still it continues. Even today I am having that uh, uh, wind blowing mm-hmm. and and uh, blockage of the ear. Okay, no problem, ma'am. Uh, still, your treatment is going on, and we are still left with thirty percent. So that thirty percent will also come down. And as I know, you are having seventy percent relief. That's a very good sign, as per your condition. And gradually, rest of the thirty percent will also come down. Okay, ma'am. Now I have a request. Like you know, there are so many people who are struggling with this problem. So can you give them a message as an awareness message? I was asked to take only four. uh three times yeah then we made it over two times mm-hmm. then when i started getting this uh, noise again you know this uh, this uh, nature of the noise has changed so i was asked to take whenever there is a noise okay. but still it continues even today i am having that uh, um, uh, wind blowing mm-hmm. and and uh, blockage of the ear Okay, no problem, ma'am. Uh, still, your treatment is going on, and we are still left with thirty percent. So that thirty percent will also come down. And as I know, you are having seventy percent relief. That's a very good sign, as per your condition. And gradually, rest of the thirty percent will also come down. Okay, ma'am. Now I have a request. Like you know, there are so many people who are struggling with this problem. So can you give them a message, as a awareness message? Hello. Hello. Okay. Okay, madam. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Now, what do you expect me to tell? Ah, uh, ma'am, just a awareness message. Like you are a patient. Like you, there are so many patients, but there is lack of awareness among people. So, can you aware them regarding tinnitus? 
see, I'm a patient of the skinny cells for the past one and a half years. Then I, I was a consulting doctor. I consulted uh, two ENT specialists. They told me the creative problem will not go. I have to suffer with this. Then I was suffering. And I used to go to the YouTube and the internet and all. I saw it, this uh, advertisement of this uh, instrument. Then I said, why not to try this? Then I started, I tried this. Then I felt better after six months. Better means the uh, sound did not go absolutely, but I used to have a headache and giddiness and heaviness and get irritated. And hard of hearing was also there. Then after starting with the instrument therapy, I felt all the uh, heaviness and giddiness and the irritability also stopped. And the nature of the sound started coming down. Hello? Yes, ma'am. Thank you so much, ma'am. Ma'am, last thing, can I put this audio feedback on my YouTube channel to create awareness among people? Okay, madam. Okay, thank you so much, ma'am.